Drinking tea on the Daniel fast is a question that comes up often. And the answer is that it depends, but mostly no. You see, black tea, white tea, green tea, oolong tea, and even some artificially decaffeinated teas contain some amount of caffeine. The Daniel Fest does not include these teas. You see, caffeine is a stimulant or drug that excites or speeds up the activity in your nervous system, including your brain. Caffeine may increase cortisol levels in some people. High cortisol levels are associated with weight gain and insulin resistance, which leads to prediabetes and type 2 diabetes. While stress is the primary driver of high cortisol levels, caffeine is one you can more simply remove from your life. Also, caffeine can often be the culprit in poor sleep. Caffeine generally has a half-life of five to seven hours, but we metabolize it with the liver enzyme, and as we get older, the speed of caffeine clearance often declines. So it's best to avoid all forms of caffeine during the fast. Herbal tea may be included in the Daniel fast, although they should not have any added artificial sweeteners or flavorings. Also, if herbal tea is a habit for you, you may consider giving it up as a sacrifice to make during the fast. Instead, stick with the beverage of choice during the fast, which is water. After all, that's what Daniel drank.